All right, well, hi everybody. Uh, I hope you can hear me okay. It's a little bit noisy in here. This is part of the vendor room at uh, Days of the Dead in Annapolis. Um, over here in the corner is uh, uh, Kane Hodder, uh, Ed Furlong. Uh, this is actually Michael Bean's table over here, but he's away right now, I think, doing photos. That's his wife. Uh, some people from Aliens back here. Over here is uh, C.J. Graham and Jim Winburn. Uh, we got a poster vendor back here with some uh, little werewolf statues. Looks like the the monster from uh, Goosebumps, maybe. Uh, so this is Kim Pacino. Satsuma, uh, kind of forget how to say the name, but he played he played Hydra in Godzilla vs. Hydra, and then he played Godzilla, I believe, 1985 through like 98. So Godzilla vs. Biollante and Fire Godzilla, um, he he played in those. Let's see here into the vendor room. Lots of vendors here. Lots of. NECA figures, lots of other uh, oddities. Here's a, a table where they have all kinds of just kind of bizarre things to me. A bat skeleton, big tarantulas. Uh, oh. So nice, nice selection of uh, living dead dolls here. That's from the video game. Uh, several Jason masks. You got the video game style, part five. Uh, it kind of looks like part six to me. Uh, there's the newer uh, Chucky uh, from Mezco. I wouldn't mind getting one of them. Dawn of the Dead and Friday the 13th Mezcos. Lots of NECA figures over here. More NECA, Pops. A lot of different artists set up here. Figures. Uh, this is a good table back here with some older figures. I actually picked up uh, Big Daddy from Land of the Dead and a uh, S-Mart Ash from Army of Darkness. Back here at this table a little while ago, they had a Shogun Warriors Godzilla. I already asked, he wasn't for sale, but now he's not even out. Uh, so this is one I want to plug. Uh, this is VHS PS. If you're looking for any out of print, hard to find movie that used to be available on VHS and is not out on DVD, check their website. Um, I bought. Godzilla 1985 off of them, Return of the Living Dead 2 that still had the original good soundtrack. And uh, they have pretty good prices. The, uh, yeah, more discs on the back.
I've got that big one there where they're in the theater. Yeah. I bought that one and I bought the one where Ash is driving Christine. So that's something I've never seen before. Star Trek Hot Wheels. That's kind of different. I like some of these. Uh, the Pennywise is a good one. That Jigsaw is a good one. The one that has everybody back here is a really good one. That's $150. I like the one where Michael and Freddie and Jason are around the jack-o'-lantern. Jason reaching for you. Uh, there's a guy back here making masks. You can see Bruce Campbell there, Freddie, Bela Lugosi, Karloff, Terminator back there, Conan in the back corner. Pretty nice, uh, pretty nice work. Uh, Flash Gordon is here, Sam Jones, but he's not at his table at the moment. Uh, more stuff here on the side. I like the Vincent Price t-shirts. Yep. Here's uh, my little demon toys. Cute onesies. Dress your kid in whatever you like. Lots of pop figures. There you go. There's a a pop claw game. And scare bears. Scarebears.com for that. Another artist with some cool stuff. I like the zombie Charlie Brown in the middle. I've always been kind of a Charlie Brown fan anyway. Kind of cool puppet master toy and the gingerbread man. I like these, but they're a little bit pricey. These 3D uh, framed artworks. 
there's creep show there's uh, killer clowns over there there's a real cool he-man one down there another creep show monster squad dawn of the dead up there there's one back there on the wall the green lit up one in the middle is the fog I like those signs back there, like the Smith's Grove one. I ought, to, I ought to make something like that out in the shop. Got some Godzilla toys here. Star Trek, William Shatner's here this weekend, so there's a lot of Star Trek. Enamel pins and patches. Oh, there's Evil Dead the musical. Oh, here we go. These are something I've bought before. Phantasm Christmas ornaments and Evil Dead Christmas ornaments. Uh, pieces from Dawn of the Dead. I may have to get that. I've got the Evil Dead 2 one. So we're going to come back by here. Yeah. Sorry. A lot of uh, vintage VHS and old video discs, if someone was interested. Back here in the back corner is where William Shatner was sitting when we got his autograph. I was kind of surprised they've got their headliner in the vendor room, but it, the convention's not too busy tonight. Of course, this is the first night. I'm sure it'll be a lot busier tomorrow. So, a lot of uh, decals and t-shirts here. Sergeant Slaughter is here this weekend. Okay, Sid Haig is back here in the corner signing autographs. Let's see if we can see him as we go by. He's always ahead at these things. He's at every one of them, it seems like, and he's always got a line, so he's got a lot of autographs out here. There's a couple of the actors from the original It miniseries. And we're back to Flash Gordon again, so that's the whole vendor room. I'm going to stop here, and uh, if you can make it out to one of these shows, do it. If you're in the Midwest, I know that they do uh, Indy, Louisville, Chicago. Um, so it's a good time uh, with that I'll talk to you later I'll be posting a video uh, at some point showing what we picked up thanks for watching like and subscribe for more